Just saw the new trailer for Poor Things starring Emma Stone, Mark Ruffalo, and Willem Dafoe. I think we're in for a wild ride with this one. It looks as though Stone's character Bella dies and is given a new, more youthful brain. The film is based off the 1992 novel of the same name by Scottish writer Alasdair Gray. Just look at the poster for this film. It's a bit unsettling. She's kind of got that Todd Phillips Joker look to her. This is a Yorgos Lanthimos film. You may know him from his other films, The Lobster, The Favorite, and The Killing of a Sacred Deer. Fun side note, this director is a former professional basketball player. His storytelling style is to take outlandish concepts and have his characters play it totally straight as if it's the most normal thing. For instance, what animal would you like to become if you can't find a romantic partner within 45 days? Uh, lobster. Yeah, I'm gonna go with lobster. The tone is often entirely serious with the absurdity of the concept providing comic relief. It's definitely an acquired taste. One way or another, his films will make you feel something. You often feel tension, discomfort, relief, laughter, and an odd sense of empathy and remorse. There's often a set of rules that his characters have to follow, and we don't understand the origin of those rules, just that the characters have to follow them. You often leave his films questioning your own world and some of the arbitrary rules that we follow, whether they make sense or not. He often takes seemingly insignificant moments and through camera work or cinematography, tells the audience why that moment is important. If you're looking for a starting point for Lanthimos films in preparation for poor things, you can check out The Lobster. It's currently streaming on HBO Max. Max. Poor Things hits theaters September 8th, 2023. What did you think of this wild looking film? Let me know down in the comments. Be sure to check out my most recent movie review of Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse, subscribe, and I will catch you in the next one.